It really is warm out there. Yeah. Yeah, you know, it's the warmest day of 2017 so far, and we haven't been this warm since November. So wow. I feel like I saw a lot of people out there with sunglasses <laughs> and shorts. That's how we are in the Northwest. You know, yeah. we get a sunny day. Yeah. It's summer. It's, it doesn't outside. matter what day it is. 60 degrees, people start taking their shirts off. Yeah, uh, hey, totally. I am definitely one of those people. I'm saying it's balmy. Take the coat <laughs> you take off. Your shirt off. You don't take your shirt off. But <laughs> oh, we understand what no, you mean. I meant my you coat off. Take you my, get okay. your sun. Let's right. just go outside. Let's just go outside. So okay. let's, let's, let's see the forecast. Let's okay, see. here's a live look outside right now. Out at the coast, beautiful people are taking a stroll out there with their dogs. If you are taking uh, out a walk around downtown Portland, beautiful out there as well. The gorge, green conditions, and up at Mount Hood Meadows, we do see some skiers out there. All right, currently looking at our forecast for tonight, we will start to see some clouds moving in. It's going to be a pleasant evening, but increasing clouds as rain returns late tonight into tomorrow morning. A prolonged period of some wet weather ahead Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. And then we do have possible flooding happening Tuesday and Wednesday. We're going to be watching some of our river levels because we've got some high snow levels and melting snow on top of the heavy rain. So that's going to be something we're looking to next week. The reason we're so warm right now, we're under this ridge of high pressure. You can see the clouds kind of going up like a mountain here, bringing some warmer conditions towards our area. But look at this. As you move to the east, they are dealing with some snow towards Minneapolis, Omaha. Uh -huh. Very much like winter still for the Midwest. Lucky for us, we're enjoying this dry day. We do have a few high clouds out there. A few sprinkles moved through the Dalles earlier for today, but right now mostly clear conditions. As we move into our forecast for this evening, temperatures will slowly drop, but it's pretty mild. 64 degrees in Salem, upper 50s out in Bend, 53 degrees in Seattle, 69 degrees in Medford. We're seeing temperatures in the upper 50s for Hood River, 65 degrees out in Tillamook. A beautiful day to go take a walk on the beach. Highs for today, we were in the low 60s again. Portland, Vancouver, we got to 58 degrees in Astoria, 66 degrees in Corvallis. Things are going to change, though. This is just one day, and then we're right back to our wet pattern by tonight into tomorrow. So here's that rain and cloud forecast. So for this evening, you do see mostly dry conditions, cloudy conditions out there as well. As we move into later tonight, keep your eye up here towards the story. This is where we start to see the moisture moving in. For your commute tomorrow, it's going to be wet towards the coast by 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock, 9 o'clock. Some heavy rain starts to move through downtown Portland, moving towards Hood River, out towards the coast in Tillamook and Pacific. City. This rain just continues all day long. You notice this dark color, the green, the yellow, that's had heavy downpours. That's going to continue through Monday night. We have a few uh, lows moving through, which is just going to stall that cold front, just keeping that rain coming all the way through the next several days. So again, 80% is late tonight. We do have chances Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Pretty confident these are going to be those wet days. We do get a little bit of a break for Thursday, then rain does return for Friday. But your forecast for tonight, temperatures dropping into the mid-40s, increasing clouds with cloudy skies late tonight. 5 to 10 mile per hour winds from the southeast, so pretty mild out there. Forecast for tomorrow, temperatures in the mid 50s, so we will cool down just a little bit. More to seasonal average temperatures, south winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. Your forecast for tomorrow, we will see scattered showers out towards the coast, 56 degrees in Salem. Again, maybe some scattered showers or out towards the eastern part of the state, but definitely rainy for tomorrow. Here's your forecast for the next seven days. Heavy at times, Tuesday and Wednesday, mostly dry for Thursday. And then, you know, Friday, St. Patrick's Day, we have a rain chance. And continues into the weekend. St. Patrick's Day already. I know. This year is flying by. It is. And you know, spring is a week from tomorrow. A week from tomorrow. Official start gotcha. of spring. Ah, uh, uh, then. Bring yeah. it on. More sunshine. Yes.